one in Tyler Shelvin. This was a, a big announcement that happened yesterday. We mentioned inside the headlines that Jamar Chase made it official yesterday on his Twitter account, uh, coming out and making a statement, uh, thanking LSU, uh, looking forward to what's next. Kind of given the you know uh, a little bit of the the behind the scenes of what into uh, you know what went into this decision uh, as he went on to say we are living in such an unprecedented time and despite the ongoing pandemic my teammates and I have worked hard this off season preparing to defend the national championship we know uh, we know the expectations in front of us uh, and are doing all that we can to accept the challenge working toward new goals set for ourselves individually and as the team. Uh, and as we read the, the 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 portion of the statement inside headlines, you know, Chase went on to say the competitor in him badly wants to play this season and go to the war with his brothers. But during this time with so much going on, uh, he's got to look out for his best interest uh, for both he and his family. Uh, and he said that uh, he'll look forward to returning to the field in 2021 uh, when he is, uh, you know, a part of the NFL draft. And for somebody like Jamar Chase, as we explained yesterday, Chase is a Chase is a he's a top three pick. I mean, if he doesn't put on another pad for 365 days uh, and, and the next evaluation he goes through is the NFL combine and the NFL draft, he's got enough film out there of, of showing his talent and skill against big-time competition where a lot of the questions have been answered around Jamar Chase. I mean, you know the quality of wide receiver that you're going to get if you make the choice to choose Chase. And, you know, I would expect him to keep himself in shape, to keep his skill level up until that time um, because of the type of prospect he is and with so much at stake, right? I mean, the, the, the value of Chase down the line, um, he's a lottery ticket. You know, I mean, Jamar Chase is a Powerball ticket right now as we speak. Tyler Shelvin um, is, is a little bit of a there's value there, but there's more questions than there is any type of, of, of demand that, that you know you're going to get the talent. You know what you're going to get in Jamar Chase. I, I know exactly what I'm getting with Chase when he shows up. You're getting a, a, a dynamic football player, an incredible athlete, uh, a guy that is motivated, uh, somebody that, that understands that the best is in front of him and he's going to work hard and try to get there. I, I know what I'm getting in Chase. I still got questions about Shelvin. I, I think questions about Shelvin that he could have answered here in another season of football. I have no spot. I've got no place. I, I have, uh, th th this has no, um, you know, I, I don't have, um, I don't have the credentials to criticize Tyler Shelvin for making the best decision for he and his family. But when I look at it from a football standpoint, good luck to Tyler Shelvin. I, I hope he goes on to be a first-round pick and takes care of the people around him in Lafayette that, that, have, that have supported him to get to this point. He is a fantastic football player. Um, he is an incredible athlete at 300 pounds for the way that he can run, move. Uh, he is going to be in high demand uh, for NFL teams once it's officially uh, you know, announced that he's in the draft, but there will be question marks around his motivation and his ability to keep that weight off and keep that weight down, even as um, you know, even as 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 short as a couple of weeks ago, Ogeron was here still trying to motivate Shelvin to lose weight on one of his Tuesday stop-ins. Uh, we were asking him on the way out if there's anything that he wanted to say. He said, "Yeah, Tyler, Big T, we got to keep Big T, uh, you know, uh, underweight." And I would, I would imagine that being outside the program uh, and being outside of the people that are constantly looking over your shoulder, making sure that you're, you're, you're eating the correct stuff. You've got a nutrition center right there on site. Uh, you've got defensive line coaches and, and, and coaches around you that are always uh, motivating you and making sure that, that, that the best uh, is in front of you. Uh, without that, I've got concern with Tyler Shelvin from the football player standpoint that that he can be out of the game that long and keep himself in shape um and and you know be ready for the NFL draft it, his film is incredible when he is right um you know it could be argued that 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 he has been good as much as you've had to motivate him at LSU i mean the first couple of years it was 
you know, when can you get on the field consistently? He couldn't get on the field consistently until he handled his weight. Uh, and once they got him motivated to handle his weight, once he got on the field, he was good. But still, once he got on the field and he got banged up a little bit and was away from playing, that, that weight shot up again. So, um, like I said, from the personal choice, I, I don't have the credentials to, to, to criticize or, 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 or tell Tyler Shelvin what, what's right or wrong. You know, I mean, that's, that's his decision. He made it. Uh, from somebody that's that 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 is a fan of LSU, you know, football, I support that and hope that he, hope that he he maximizes that choice. Um, I'd imagine that 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 NFL decision makers would have been a lot more secure in choosing him if they would have had ten more games of film to evaluate uh, and one more season of college football to see him stay on top of his weight and take care of everything that goes into being a football player. We'll ask Coach Ogeron about that decision next, coming up here on Off the Bench.